day. It's day three of our big boy adventure. We're getting ready to part. We're getting ready to part Portola to chase it up the Feather River Canyon. This is going to be a fun day. Today's chase of the Union Pacific Big Boy is going to be fun because we'll be chasing it through the Feather River Canyon on the old Western Pacific, a route certainly made famous by the legendary California Zephyr on its western trek into Oakland, California. Before the train's departure from here in Potola, we get a sense of calm, except for the jackhammering being done on the road over there. Amongst the equipment being pulled on this train is UP Heritage Unit 1983. This locomotive was newly refurbished and brought in to act as dynamic braking for this trip. And with that, the chase is on. The train departed Portola and headed through areas such as Warner Valley, Mabel, Gold Mountain, and into Clio over the Clio Trestle before taking a northward direction toward areas such as Pluma Sarica, right up to Spring Garden, where we met the train alongside California State Route 70. And as you can see, this spot has a great view of the valley and the railroad tracks, which is great to capturing the big boy on its way to Roseville. After passing Spring Gardens, it will go around the Williams Loop before heading northward to Massac, Quincy Junction, right up to Ketty. As the train passes through Ketty, we find ourselves another spot to watch it in action, Butterfly Swimming Hole. During the making of this video, I couldn't help but notice the name of the road, Roundhouse. And upon further research, this was because there was a roundhouse built by the Western Pacific when they owned this line. After passing through Ketty, the train will cross the Ketty Y before heading towards Paxton, the Feather River Hot Springs, Twain, 
the Pine Air Motel Resort, and Virgilia before heading westward. It would have been nice to get footage of the big boy on the Caddy Y, but due to the crowd size and the need to get ahead of the train, we'll show you what we got instead at Virgilia. Our next point of interest is Belden, California, where we get a clear shot of the big boy entering the tunnel. Afterwards, the train will go through Rogers Flat and Tobin, where we get another great shot of the big boy from across the river. After passing through Tobin, the train will cross the river near Tobin Resort before passing through Rock Crest, Story, and over the Rock Creek Trestle. After that, the train will continue southward on the Feather River route. However, due to construction and traffic delays, we just decided to head to Oroville and try to catch it when the train made a stop within the city. However, it was later decided that we should head further south and to get ahead of the train. And we found our location in a small community called Rio Oso, where we caught the big boy racing toward its final destination, Roseville, California. I hope y'all had a fun time on this chase of the big boy through the Feather River Canyon. And I hope you guys stay tuned for when we talk about the two days of the big boy in Roseville, California. But until then, See you later, folks, and may your gifts bless the world.